thought a tough ass cutie such as myself would be writing a love poem. <laughs> God, I am not about that corny crap. I have been using poetry as a coping mechanism, a way to vent my teenage angst and bipolar debris. But writing about something, or someone rather, that makes me happy won't hurt. Gary, I wish you were here tonight, but sadly you live 533.5 miles away, just a little, little farther than Albuquerque in the opposite direction. I often kick myself for falling in love with some loser who lives in another state, but knowing I'll, I'll see said loser again makes, me, makes it okay. I've never written a love poem before, so this may not be the best. Similarly, I've never loved someone like this before, so naturally I'm subject to messing up, but I am trying. Well, I'm trying. It's not even so much your looks and your personality that I'm in love with, though those are important as well. It's the little things. Of course, I'm a, uh, I have obsessive compulsive disorder. It's how you know me so well. It's how if my text messages aren't at least 80% comical, you know something is wrong and you ask if I need a phone call. It's how I could be crying my eyes out on the phone and just hearing your voice, just hearing, it'll be okay, hon can actually make me feel your arms around me again, and suddenly it's easier to fall asleep. It's how you're so sensitive about sex, because you know how it makes me feel. Hell, the first time we had sex, I started crying, and you just held me and told me I had nothing to feel sorry about. I swear, we're like some corny, angsty, John Green type book, because you're schizophrenic and I'm bipolar, and yeah, most of us think that that's a recipe for disaster, but I think it makes us that much more perfect for each other. Plus our meds look super cute next to each other. <laughs> <laughs> Gary, there's not a day that I don't picture your lips on mine again, my hand in yours, and me in your arms. Not a day that I don't picture us picking out towels for our place, or buying bacon for you and tofu for myself. Gary, I love you, and there's not a day that I'm any less about you. Thank <laughs> you.